there is no one who is like you. You are from everlasting to everlasting. You are the beginning and the end. Father, I thank you. Father, I praise you. You are so good. You are wonderful. You are good in my life. You are good in the life of others. Receive all the honor. Receive all the glory. I just want to thank God for who he is in my life. Who he is in my family's life. I have been thanking God for who he is in my life and the father he has taken me. I repent all the sins that I have committed. I repent the sin of my family. I repent the sin of my nation. And today I just want to praise you God because you are a merciful God. So as I was praying, uh, I found myself repenting the sin that uh, were committed, you know, uprooting any voice that may have been spoken against my life, any voice that may have been spoken against my family. And I have uprooted in the name of Jesus as I also pray for forgiveness of sin. I have analyzed my life and what I have gone through and the fact that my mother passed away um, and she never lived to see this day. And my father had passed away many years ago and leaving my mother to take care of us and God has been faithful to us. And as I pray, I am remembering my family and remembering my daughter and seeing a repeat of something that happened in my life. And I am canceling, I am canceling the works of the enemy in the name of Jesus. And whatever I have gone through in life, I am praying that my daughter will not suffer the way I have suffered in life. Whatever the word that was spoken by whoever, I come against it right now in the name of Jesus. And I'm so grateful because God is faithful and I believe and I trust that my daughter will have a good life. My daughter will not be affected in the name of Jesus. I am here to stand for generations and I am here to encourage mothers to pray for their children. Pray for your children, children. Pray from your great grandchildren, the ones you have not seen, the, one that, the ones that will come in the future. So if you have gone through issues in your life, I just want to encourage you to stand in the gap and cancel so that whatever you have gone through will not affect your daughter, will not affect your son, will not affect even the relationship of your of your daughter with her spouse to be, your 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 son and, and his spouse to be in the mighty name of Jesus. Stand in the gap. In the name of Jesus Christ. So I am so happy that God has enabled me to do that. And I will continuously continue to pray. And uh, I believe that God is faithful and God is merciful. And God will bless us in the name of Jesus. He will bless us and he will bless our families. And he will bless our children. He will bless our children, children. Because he is good. And he is a, a faithful God. Thank you, Jesus. I love you, Lord. I worship your name. I exhort you. And uh, you are a wonderful God. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen and amen.